coyotes has been on a downward spiral. Their videos are literally just them fixing scratch discs, which sure are pretty cool, but do you want a quarter of a million subscribers channel to make videos on scratch discs? Now, shipping videos isn't any better because it's kind of boring. Plus, they made like at least 76 videos on it that were definitely double stale. I said it was going to be stale, but they're still doing it because they can't really do anything else. Remember, DKODs is a store about video games, not a YouTube channel. So that may give me to another point. This is the thing that DKOD is criticized the most for, so I'm not going to go in depth, but seriously, their store is insanely overpriced. But first, let me go introduce you to a game called Earthbound. It's a great RPG, but you way you think that DKOD will sell it for $60, $100, or $200. So those are one of the prices that will probably, probably pop up when you try to buy it. Well, it's $800. I legit can't explain how much money that is. Do you even want to have a context? Then the PS5, the modern consoles right now, costs like at least $500. That's insane. People may be thinking you're paying more for quality, but that's not the case. By telling from their videos, they obviously want to have a reputation of being really clean and they probably clean their stuff and it's really really good. But that's not the case because they actually lied to you. A man from Reddit brought something from DKODs and, and you can tell that it's not a really good condition. You may think it's just a one time thing and they probably won't do it to another customer but they're dead wrong. A full 13 minute video explaining the Wii they got from DKODs is on right now and you can tell that the Wii is in awful condition. You can get one better on eBay that's extremely cheaper. The fact that Earthbound is $800 but doesn't even come with a case or something. That's crazy because you're paying a fortune just to get a SNES game that you can get for way cheaper on eBay. There's a legit no good reason to lose DK Odys for something like eBay. Because on eBay you can see what you're getting on DK Odys, you just get a random Google image. You're be getting better stuff on eBay except for the extremely low percentage of being scanned on eBay. It's extremely low but DK Odys made it seem like it's happening all the time. If you go on the platform you're going to get what you get if you don't get what you get then there's a returning option so there's another reason to not lose the coyotes I think I said what needs to be said. If you guys want more information on DK Odie's extremely pricey stuff, then I recommend watching the second the second video. 